Welcome back, everybody. Your host, AMF1534, here. And let's do some more exploring on Let's Play Amnesia the Dark Descent. Last time we got that hand roll put together, but now we don't know where to go. And that is a big problem. And I can hear some lady screaming, but I don't know where she's screaming from. Because there's a room that we cannot get into. But I'd love to know where it is. But they don't want me to know where it is. And I don't like that. Because this door over, over here, or somewhere nearby, does not want to cooperate with me and allow me to find the way in. But I really want to know how to get in. There's got to be some way. Some way. Oh yeah, and there's that giant, giant cave-in with blood everywhere. So obviously there's something going on here. Huh. Yeah, I'll be honest with you, I really, really don't know what to do at this juncture. And that, my friend, is bad news. Yeah, I need to find a way to get through, but I don't know exactly how I'm going to do that. Oops. My bad. It's the, uh, wrong button button there. Huh. Yeah, this is, uh, rather bad. This is Dan rather bad. I don't know what the hell that was that I just threw, but I threw it there. Nothing there. Wow, it's dark in there. Good gravy. I would just, I'd really love to think that there was something that I needed in this room. But obviously, there isn't. Otherwise, there would be no reason for me to keep on coming in here. I feel like I'm just like, making my pain and suffering worse by continuing to come in this room even though I know there's nothing in here that I need. And I would love it if that woman would stop making that noise. Ah! Obviously, it's a little too dark in there for me to handle it. There's gotta be somewhere to go. Yeah, why is a great question. And she is just struggling right now. I wonder. I wonder if I use that surgical needle. Nope. Nope, obviously can't drill that thing open. There's gotta be some way to open that thing. Huh. Apparently not. Alright, so we are now stuck. That is really bad. Really, really bad. And I don't feel like there's any other way around this. I've already been in every room. Son of a bitch. The part that's stupid about this is that I guarantee you, I guarantee you that the answer is like right in front of my face and I'm just not seeing it. And that's what sucks. I just fucking know it. I mean, why do I still have the surgical needle? It's gotta be for something. I'm pretty sure I can't go down this yet. Yeah, it's not working. Which is a good thing, in the long run, because I don't want to go down there without going where I need to go. And I've already been in here. God damn it. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to go in the machine room if I don't have all the parts for the machine room. Oh, and 
that's the, the study, and then there's the guest room. Whoa, that was not here last time. What in the world? There's a freaking severed torso up here. Holy shit. What in the world was going on here? Uh... Yikes. I wonder... what will happen... if I put the body in the water. Just by... Nothing? Nothing on that one? Okay. Give me the goddamn body then. How would that body even be there? That wasn't from that dude that I caught up in there, was it? Oh. Why would there be a discarded severed body on the ground? Surgical needle on that, maybe? Nope. God, I don't want to go back in here again. But I don't have a choice. There's like nothing left I can do. I think. Dude, there's gotta be something. I mean, it just doesn't make any sense. I can hear her godforsaken voice back here. You'd think there'd be like a fake wall or something. I mean, that's already worked for me once in this series, if I remember correctly. I can swear that I used a fake wall, or a hole in the wall somewhere, to get me somewhere. And she's gotta be, she's gotta be in here, I mean, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Like, you'd almost think that drilling the door open would work, but at the same time, that doesn't make very much sense. Dude, there's gotta be something. There's only four of those left. There's nothing... Nothing to be found anywhere. There's just a giant pile of blood and then a huge cave-in. So what the fuck? Yeah, I would love to go to freaking Partes Machinam. Probably said that horribly wrong. But, at this juncture, I really don't care want to get where I need to go. I don't know how to do that right now. Another valuable waste of a tinderbox just to find nothing. Man, this is super gay. You guys are probably sitting there right now laughing at me. Why hasn't he done this yet? Why hasn't he done this yet? Well, I'd love to be able to know, but I can't fucking figure it out because I'm apparently the stupidest person walking the earth. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, this is making minimal amounts of sense to me right now. There's no obvious way in here. And it's driving me nuts. really would not, or really would like to not have to resort to doing something retarded, i.e. looking at like a walkthrough or something, that would be pretty stupid. You guys probably think I'm an idiot, which I am. There's nothing in any of these rooms that's going to do anything for me. Just a bunch of shovels. I'm wasting a lot of lantern oil doing this, so I better not use it. I'm very, very upset with what's going on right now. Just a slab of wood and a chest that I'm almost positive I opened already. It sure did. Nope. Still nothing. A, a lever. I don't even know what that is. I'm not going to say what I think it is because it's probably nothing. Alright, well, this 
entire episode was pretty much a failure, because we got nothing accomplished whatsoever. But, stick around for the next one. Maybe in that one, I will be able to find something of relative use somewhere. Hopefully, that would be nice. So, this is your host, AMF1534, saying goodbye for now, and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.